as we prepare to begin the first steps of the Divine Liturgy. If you recall the article in the ministry that appeared just about a month ago, the first exclamation that we hear, the call to attention by the priest, Evlogimeni Vasilia tu Patros Ketuyuk tu Epnematos, blessed is the kingdom of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. It is a call of attention to the assembled faithful to prepare themselves for the journey that we strive to take together to bring us to the kingdom of God. I encourage all of you to open the liturgy books that are found in front of you in the pews. Much of what I am saying, I will point out some of the uh, priest hymns that will explain what is happening in even greater detail. So as we conclude with the prayers of Othros, with the doxology, with the cry of attention, the priest will say a few uh, prayers as he venerates the holy altar, as he kisses the gospel, prepares to begin the liturgy. The response of the people to the call to attention, that very simple yet powerful prayer of Amin or Amen is just so important as it concludes. It shows the attentiveness of all those gathered and it shows and says in, ver in a very clear way that we are all here to participate. It is a closing of the opening prayer. It is as, as if saying, come join us on this trip to heaven and the people respond by saying Amen and in that way say, Yes, let us go. Glory to God in the highest and on earth peace, goodwill among all. Glory to God in the highest and on earth peace, goodwill among all. Glory to God in the highest and on earth peace, goodwill among all. O Lord, you will open my lips and my mouth shall declare your praise. O Lord, you will open my lips and my mouth shall declare your praise. Standing in the temple of your glory, we feel as though in heaven, O Theotokos, heavenly gate, open for us the door of your mercy. Evlogimeni Vasil. 